dear brothers and sisters we have just ended the season of great lent every year we celebrate the lent season one day or the other we can call it 50 days for it god is inviting us this day this moment to turn to god to spend more time in prayer to examine our past and present life it is a time to sit quietly to listen quietly to respond quietly a time to say goodbye to our past sinful life and turn to god to his rich and mercy throughout bible we could see how jesus won the world he never won the world with a sword but with the love and the gifts the heart of human being aspires the great things lofty values deep friendship ties that are strengthened rather than broken by the trials of life the human being aspires to love and to be loved god is the first to love he does not love because there is something in us that endangers love god loves us because he himself is love and by its very nature love tends to spread and give it god's forgiveness is a symbol of his overflowing love for each of us it is the love that leaves us free to listen ourselves like the prodigal son but which awaits our return every day it is a resource of love of the shepherd for the lost sheep it is the tenderness which welcomes each sinner who knocks at his door jesus says come to me if you're tired oppressed and i will give you rest he set a perfect example of kindness and love to walk the gospel and those that his love has no borders by healing a lame man on the sabbath by raising Lazarus from death by turning water into wine by feeding of the 5000 by healing a man born blind healing the lepers return of the prodigal son it's the parable shows god's love for us not depends on our faithfulness it is unconditional the woman caught in adultery when everybody accused her jesus cared for her most pressing needs he did not condemn the woman but extended grace mercy and forgiveness for francis says that the prodigal son returned home asking forgiveness for what he has done and telling his father no longer deserve to be called your son but on the contrary the holy father continued the only thing that matters to the father is that his son has returned home safe and sound god the father runs out to embrace him restore his dignity by giving him clothes sandals etc in the thought of pope francis let us live this landed season stop dwelling in the past find god in the present open your hearts to jesus offer all your struggles difficulties and disappointments of your life to jesus listen to the words of jesus speaking to us in the gospel pray with the words of disciples lord stay with us